pretty boys and girls. That's it. That's all. We're on the daily wrap up. Uh, okay, so this is something new that we're going to keep trying for a little bit. See how it works out. Uh, just because I'm doing the same thing over and 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 over again. I know that was scary, wasn't it? So uh, we're going to try this daily wrap up thing. We're going to insert some clips here and there. Uh, of stuff that I see during the day if uh, it's noteworthy if you will and uh, just you know talk about the day uh, if I do anything you know if I'm driving to Kitchener or if I go to Mount Jolly again or Quebec City or whatever you know I'll do some road videos there too I'll do some separate plus I want to do some separate videos of different stuff back to you know the teaching and advice stuff and you know, just showing you some ideas that I have and uh you know, I thought my phone was ringing there. It just looked really weird. But anyway, uh, that was I saying. Okay, yeah. So, uh, so there's going to be added content. There's going to be different stuff. So we're going to just do change the vlog around to like a daily wrap up type deal, and you know, show you a few things like, well, like how my day started, for example. Oh my goodness. Yep. It is snow. <laughs> Yucky, yucky snow on the ground. Ew. I know. <laughs> I don't want the snow. Alrighty, just to add in, uh, as you can see, the road has a few dusted covers of, uh, I don't even know what to call it, flurry sections on the road. There's also a few dark patches. Uh, some of it is just wet, but other parts of it are frozen. So, cold weather tip uh, number one, if you will, is basically keep an eye out for the different color variations on the road, as they can mean uh, multiple uh, different things. Um, you know, don't let it deceive you in thinking that it's just wet. Especially when you had a lot of moisture and then, you know, everything froze up overnight. Um, so you could have a mixture of wet and frozen, depending on the amount of traffic that's been going over the road. Don't, uh, basically the, the tip is to slow down a little bit. Increase your stopping distance. And uh, don't rush, let's say for example like this, don't rush the light trying to race the light and get to it and then uh, you get part way in the intersection turning the corner and you could hit a, an icy section and just basically slide right through doesn't take much on asphalt to uh, freeze the road so anyways that's my tip all right so yeah wasn't that exciting huh yeah i know white crap so that's how the day started you know other than the fact that i fell on my ass twice today because all the moisture and rain and crap that was on the ground and whatnot all froze overnight, obviously. And got covered by a light layer of the snow. And, of course, hooking up the trailer ended up... It was just solid ice. And I'm not, I'm not showing you, but over there, yeah. Anyways, it was just a nice thin, thin, thin layer of ice there. And I walked back, gave the tires a thump, and <laughs> I kicked the tires down. I went right on my ass. It's a good thing I got lots of padding. So, but anyways, more pride hurt than anything. And the sad part was, you'd think I would have learned after the first time doing it. Ooh, I did it a second time. Yes, sir. So, that was exciting. Yep, I know. So, alrighty. Uh, let's see here. Uh, other than that, we moved. Uh, we didn't move much for trailers today. You know, just four trailers, I think. Uh, went into Dorval, did a delivery. You just gotta kick yourself when you do stupid stuff. Yeah, it would appear this was a bad choice. I made a wrong turn, and then I figured, well, we'll just go around the long way. And yeah, so not so good. Now we got bumper to bump drop. Had I made the right turn the right way and did it the way I was supposed to, I probably wouldn't have had any of this. Would have been much shorter. No. This is what happens when you're in a rush and you don't pay attention. Uh, 
All right, yeah, you see more and more and more and more and more people that have that. And I don't see no uh, exterior air conditioner or anything on the roof or anything like that. Um, yeah, that's about it, really. And then took a shower, came back here. I'm all prettied up. Yeah, prettied up. You see, Bob, I am. So anyway, yeah, so we're going to cut this one short. I'm going to work on this. This is a work in progress for the daily wrap-up. And the clips, I'm going to add clips, pictures, uh, whatever I do during the day, you know, instead of doing continuous uh, video of it. So I'm going to try to, you know, make it, still make it interesting for you, but it's going to be at the end of the day. They're not going to be 20-minute uh, vlogs anymore. Stuff like that are 15 minutes, 10 minutes. Uh, this one might turn out to be a little bit longer than anticipated, but like I said... And we're going to finish this week off like this. Once I'm going to try to get a routine and get a rhythm going with it. And then I want to start adding some other videos, some other content for you guys. So stay tuned. Hopefully this will work out. Anyways, that's it for today. That's all. Uh, we'll check in with you tomorrow on our daily wrap-up. And uh, we'll see how tomorrow goes. Who knows? You never know. Might fall on my ass twice again. But no, I'm not videotaping it.